everyone. Thanks for joining us. I'm Irene and this is my daughter Dominique and today we are doing a snack haul. So I wasn't intending to do a snack video but when we were shopping this last weekend there were a lot of things that I hadn't seen or tried yet so I figured I would pick up some things so that we could try. So do you care what we start with? No. Let's start with this because this one is just right in front of me. It is the Strawberry Hostess Cupcakes. And I've seen the chocolate ones, but this says that it's limited edition. So I think it's new and it actually says a hundred years. So it must be for their celebration because there's also a birthday hat in the corner. So that looks fun. Ooh. It's a big box too. I know, hopefully we like it. <laughs> yeah, if not, Noah eats anything with sugar in it. He's usually the cleanup crew, and sometimes I am too. So they're all just individually wrapped, and since this is strawberry, they're actually really pretty pink. Mm-hmm. Like pastel it. pink. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's break it open. Look at all the artificial goodness. <laughs> <laughs> let's try it. Mm. The top part is crumbly because it's like the thin layer of sugar at the top. Then it's a strawberry cake with the vanilla frosting, Pretty which good. the vanilla frosting in the center is really sweet. What'd you think? I liked it. I don't taste the strawberry though. I think it does. It sure. tastes like vanilla to me. Do you taste the strawberry? It tastes like the strawberry cake mix. That one is really sweet. So if you like really sweet sugary desserts, then you'll probably like that. But one thing that I do like about that is that it doesn't feel really foamy like the Twinkie cakes feel. Mm -hmm. I've heard a lot about that Cafe Monster thing. I've seen so many commercials. Oh, well, let's try Where it. Where he goes, Cafe Monster. Have you tried Cafe Monster? <laughs> <laughs> so this is the drink I picked up. And I was curious about this because there are several different brands of these cold coffees. So far, the ones that we tasted were trash. Right. So this one so it's not is watered down. to be Monster. So I'm hoping that it doesn't have the energy drink. No, it's just what it's called. It's like one of those Starbucks ones. Okay, well it says energy coffee. And this one is salted caramel. Oh, it might be because it has the that three stripe thing. Mm -hmm. This is the energy drink. So I think it is. it does have those agents in it. But I feel like caffeine is already like promoting energy. Mmm, smells like I coffee. can smell it from here. It's strong, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. it might be gross then. I'm not giving you any hints. It's nasty, huh? Because last time you, <laughs> you didn't want to try it. <laughs> <laughs> it's gross because if you would have told me if it was good, you would have been, oh, it's good. But when you did that, that means it's gross. That's not what it means. Yeah, it is. <laughs> try it. I like it actually. I think it's better than the other one we tried. And the okay. strange thing is that I Going normally the milk. like really sweet coffee. To me, this doesn't taste extra sweet. That tastes pretty sweet. But it doesn't taste like it still needs creamer either. It tastes like a sweet chocolate milk coffee. I think it tastes good and it smells good. Mm -hmm. I like it. Okay. I agree. So next, let's try this Snickers Maple almond butter. This looked really interesting to me because I have not seen any maple flavored Snickers before. The packaging is interesting. And it says no artificial flavors, colors, or sweeteners. So this is natural. It looks like the, you know how they put it, those natural things, they put it in that wrapping? And it feels like there's two, oh, there's actually four separate little bars. Oh. That's cute. You can see it kind of chewy. It looks like there's probably a thin layer of the almond butter, I'm guessing, and then a thin layer of the caramel. You want a small piece? Yeah. Mmm. It smells taste anything. like maple. Mm hmm This is really good. Oh, no, I taste it. Mm hmm It tastes buttery, and it tastes like maple, and then you do get some chocolate. Yeah, it's pretty soft. Mm hmm I really like this and then you get the caramel in there. Hmm, that's good. No, that's all you, girl. That's all. That's good, you like it though. Mm -hmm. I don't mind it, I thought it was fine. I think that's better than the regular Snickers, honestly. I don't remember Snickers. I prefer Twix. 
What else we got? All right, next, let's try this. This is Sun Made Sour Raisin Snacks. I definitely have never sour seen this before. Mm-hmm. Oh, and they're cute little packages. I know. So they're all just these little individual packages. Portion control, love that. Right. So you can just put these in the lunch or something? Mm-hmm. Okay. Are those silver? They look like regular raisins. And just like- They're good. Mm-hmm. I think there might be a strawberry coating on the outside. Yeah. These those like are candy. Mm-hmm. These taste like they would be a better alternative than those fruit snacks like the artificial gummy ones. Mm -hmm. Whole fruit, no sugar added, no GMOs. No artificial flavors. Those are good. A like nice those. healthy snack. Yeah, I like those. Okay. Next, we have these Reese's dipped pretzels. Reese's dips, those are gonna be basically peanut butter dips with um, probably chocolate. Mm -hmm. mm. They're light brown with the chocolate drizzle. You can smell the peanut butter from here. <laughs> oh yeah, you can. Okay. Now let's break this open. Oh. I want the little bit. I just got a little tiny Yeah. Piece. Okay, that's good. It's not bad. Mm-hmm. It's not like overpowering. No, I love those. Mm-hmm. Oh, they kind of taste like a Reese's Pieces with like a crunch. Yeah. If I didn't know it was Reese's Pieces, like if we did the blindfold, I would just say peanut butter. Really? Mm-hmm. Because Reese's Pieces is just a peanut butter thing with a chocolate coat on the outside real quick. That's what all it is. Those are good. I like the white chocolate covered pretzels. The yogurt covered ones. Mm, those are good. So this says that yeah, they're dipped in peanut butter candy and drizzled with milk chocolate. So I don't think it's real peanut butter. Oh. It's peanut butter flavored candy. I think it's so weird how they can do that. Like add fake stuff to make it taste like the real thing. Mm -hmm. But what do you just put on the real thing? Right. It's probably cheaper than whatever they're using. Maybe. Oh, sure you're right. Okay, next are these red velvet Oreos. Have we tried these before? Oh no, I couldn't remember. I think we did. Did we? I don't remember. So these look just like a regular Oreo, but they have the red cookie because it's red velvet instead of the chocolate I cookie. didn't know that red velvet is just chocolate cake with red food coloring, right? No, it has more cream cheese or something like that too. Like they add more of it hmm. and that's all the difference is. Interesting. And I was like, oh my gosh, I, I hate chocolate cake, but I love red velvet. And they're like, do you eat chocolate cake? I was like, what? <laughs> like, no, I'm not. That is good. Mm -hmm. It's different than the regular Oreo though, because I feel like the center is sweeter. The yeah. center actually tastes like a frosting, cake frosting. Yeah, those are good. Does it mm. taste a lot like the birthday cake flavor? No, that's different. You think it tastes like the birthday cake? Mm -hmm. I don't taste that. I definitely taste the cake frosting. Mm -hmm. Do you like them? Yeah, I like those better than actually the regular ones. Mm. These are good. Very sweet though, really sweet. Mm -hmm. okay. I like sweet stuff though. Okay, we're already down to our last item. Already? This is the Hershey's Waffle Layer Crunch. Oh, I wanted to and try that one. Strawberry. Mm hmm. I know, this says milk chocolate with waffle cone pieces and strawberry flavored cream. Ooh. That sounds really good, actually. Mm hmm. Oh. Those um, are thick. I know, they are really thick. Oh. Okay, so it looks like a strawberry and chocolate layer with, oh, I can see the uh, waffle cone pieces. Oh, mm -hmm. nice, okay. Two. <laughs> oh, I can't break it. Oh, that's weird. Okay, so you took a nap, right? And But it's been like two hours. <laughs> and you're still like not at your full strength? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Has that ever happened to you before? <laughs> I like can't do it. <laughs> it was like, <laughs> I definitely get the strawberry. Mm. And then the crunch from the waffle cone. I don't think I like this one. You don't like it? Mm -mm. It's almost like too much chocolate. It's a lot of chocolate. Like there should have been more of the strawberry, like a bigger chunk of the strawberry. Mm -hmm. It feels like I'm just eating a big block of chocolate. I can taste a lot kind of, of has the a weird aftertaste. strawberry flavor, but it's definitely like the artificial strawberry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's okay. 
It's not bad. Yeah, it's not bad. But I don't think it would be something that I would want to eat over and over again. Mm -hmm. Something that you crave. Mm -hmm. Right, I wouldn't pick it up again. So, okay, okay, those were all of the snacks. What did you think, favorite? Mm -hmm. I thought these were a pretty good selection. Mm -hmm. um, I think top two would have to be the raisins and the hoisted thing. The cupcake? Hostess yeah, but cupcake. I actually kind of liked that coffee drink too. Mm. The monster. Mm -hmm. I did like this, but I think that my favorite is the sour raisins. Raisins too? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I like how they don't taste like raisin raisins, but they also, if you look in there, they used the yellow ones, mm -hmm. not the dark purple. Right. So those are why it's sour. And then they just put whatever strawberry coating is on there. Mm -hmm. Right, because they still have that strawberry flavor. Mm -hmm. And at first, when I first opened it, because some of them are a little darker because of that strawberry coating. At first I thought it was dried strawberries mixed in. Mm -hmm. I don't think That would have been good too. Mm -hmm. They should have done that with the coating. I would have liked that too. So these are good. And the nice thing about this too is that I won't feel guilty eating them. Which one was your favorite from, or your least favorite I mean? Least favorite. Like which one do you think that you wish you could return like right now? I wouldn't return any of them, um, but the one that I'm least likely to have any more of is the strawberry cupcake. What? Why? I don't know. It just didn't really taste Didn't really tickle your fancy or special. You know, it just kind of tasted like one of those strawberry box mixes, like you said. Yeah. But even this red velvet Oreo, it was so sweet that I probably won't have any more. Well, I wouldn't just pop those in my mouth by, by itself. I would mix it with the ice cream or something. So anyway, mm -hmm. thank you all for watching our snack haul. And if any of these looked really good to you, please let us know in the comments. If any of these looked disgusting to you or <laughs> like something you definitely would not want to try, please let us know that too. We're super curious and try cafe monster <laughs> see you in the next one bye cafe monsters so we said have you tried cafe monster <laughs> i know actually the video that i saw of it you saw one too yeah we're having like, the people try it compared to the starbucks blindfolded mm -hmm. the blindfolded coffee that's why I was thinking that we should get like all those varieties because they have this one, Dunkin' Donuts, Store Brand, McCafe, mm -hmm. and Starbucks.